Hi guys. Yeah, I'm just down here, uh, Southwest Calgary, uh, 7th Street and Sifton Boulevard. Yeah, they got the uh, Sifton blocked off there, so I'm not too sure what they're doing, so I had to detour around this block here by the school. So we're just heading out to the casino. So we're headed westbound on on Sifton, and then we're heading up to 14th Street, up to 26th Avenue. And then it gets up to 37th Street and down to the casino. And uh, to the left is the Elbow River. It's opening up pretty good now. Most of the ice is off it. And it's uh, minus one out, so it's still on the chilly side for this time of year. It should be three degrees right now. But this is a rich area down here. It's a Upper Mount Royal. Yeah, I haven't done any videos for a while. I just haven't been uh, driving around much there with the price of gas nowadays there. So I had to cut that down. But today I decided to come in and take a, in on this special. And I decided, well, I'll just do a video on the way there. Coming up to 38th Avenue. Up to 14th Street. To the left is uh, Riverside Park. It overlooks the uh, Elbow River. And now we're on to 14th Street, one of the main north-south thoroughfares in Calgary. Make a left turn here. It's a sunny day out. It's uh, kind of the, partly overcast, but the sun is shining. But it's supposed to warm right up tomorrow and then be above normal there by the weekend. Right, here we go. I've got a green turning light if people hurry up. Meant to go down 26th Avenue, but that's okay. I'm on 33rd, and but I can get over to 26th anytime along here. Well, it looks like they're uh, doing some construction down here now. I think it used to be housed on that last corner there, but it's a new developments happening everywhere around the city. It's a really booming town now with the uh, oil prices up through the roof. St. Mark and St. Philip Church. Here yeah, in the Bankview area right at the moment. This is where they have the martyr days there in every August is down the down this area. They close off the street and put all kinds of booths up here. And yeah, I can go this way now down 20th Street over to uh, 26th Avenue. I 
I heard at one time they say this is the highest point of Calgary just up ahead there where that car is but I think there's higher places now like a Go Chill that's uh, quite high up there where the uh, T CTV studios are and but uh, back in the day before all that was built it was just open prairie up there and, and, but this used to be the highest point in the city and now we're going down the hill But the snow is going, so spring is just around the corner, so should most of it should melt away by next week there if we get up to nine, ten degrees there like they predict. Now we're coming on to 26th Avenue. light with an old turn light here so I'm gonna wait for these cars to come. Another guy walking his pooch. And another house there that looks like it's gonna be torn down and all fenced off. Yeah there's a lot of old houses there that are being knocked down and then they put the uh, big fancy new homes in there and another one right in the corner that being already taken out and they started some new development there looks like another big fancy new expensive home I think most of these bungalows that are around here were built in the 40s and 50s there's an outdoor rink right in this corner I had a friend who used to go and play hockey there all the time you know just regular hockey. Now we're still on 26th Avenue. It's 50 around the uh, main streets in Calgary, but on the side streets it's 40, so I'm just keeping just a little bit under 50 right at the moment. Because I'm not in a big hurry there to get where I'm going. I just as soon, you know, drive uh, sensibly there instead of like, got to be there right at right the moment. I've had a lot of people speed by me already there when I was coming down here before I uh, started recording. 7-Eleven, Scotiabank. And we're coming up to uh, 30th Street. Another new house going in there, uh, just down that street. Oh, there's a big dog. Don't think the camera picked it up though. Okay, I'm at my destination, so I just gotta wait for the light to change. So I might as well shut this camera off for now.